hi guys i hope you guys are all doing well today i hope you are having a great month of july today i have my july tempered and ipsy or boxy charm whatever it's called um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and share that with you guys all right so for this month we got clinique happy which i've have had before and i really do like um so i'm excited for that um this one is described as this exuberant blend of bright, zesty, orange, citrus, exotic, hothouse orchids, and elegant jasmine is enhanced with delicate, tropical Hawaiian wedding flower, soft lilies, and golden magnolia. So, those are the keynotes in this one. And then the next one I tried is something called Floris from London. Um, it's called Sephiro. Um, and let's see, this one it says, Sephiro is the Spanish word for zephyr meaning small breeze, and a few spritzes of this fragrance conjures up images of the Mediterranean Sea. Opening with citrusy lime and mandarin, this aroma is blended in England and follows with spicy nutmeg before drifting into a woody accord of cedar and sandalwood. So that is what it bottle looks like. And this is the back for that one. All right, so let's see. Ooh, this one's pretty. So my Sempered container of the month is this hot pink. Love that. That is super pretty. And let's see which scent they put in this one. The Sephiro one. So let's see what it smells like. Hmm. Let's see. I feel I pick up on something. Very strong. It definitely is a musk. Maybe with a little bit of the bergamot. I don't smell jasmine at all in it, but it's not it's not bad. It's kind of smells a little woodsy, I guess you would say. And then my cleaning copy is just in the normal little vial. I feel like I need to get more of the the scent bird vials. I should probably get two a month. I don't know if they can do that. I'll look into that because I don't like having them alone like this. So, all right. So let's see what I describe this one as. Mm, that one smells so nice. I love this Clinique Happy. Um, what did I say I pick up on? Honestly, just flowers. I think that's like the main thing. So... Yeah, just like a nice, pretty, delicate flower is what I get from that one. So that are those are the two scents. Um, I know last month I said that I didn't really care for one of the ones I got. I believe it was called the blue one. And what's really funny is um, I just got back from Ukraine. Um, I went on a mission trip for almost two weeks, and um, I ended up taking my scent birds so I didn't have to take perfume bottles, which was really nice because um, you know they're so they're so thin, you know, compared to a whole bottle so I took three of them and one of the ones I took was the blue one I just tossed it in and I actually ended up really really liking it which I was I was pleasantly surprised so because I know when I initially sprayed it I didn't like it at all but I ended up liking it a good bunch all right so this month's Ipsy let's see what we got all right so it says this month is um the passport to glow and it looks like this so I guess it is boxy charm, even though it says Ipsy on the box. I, I have no idea. All right, so I ended up picking up another one of these. I believe I let you guys know that I had picked this up. Um, where is the one that I have? It's around here somewhere. I don't remember where I put it, but oh yeah, it's over there. Um, I bought this to go to Ukraine um, to take with me on my trip. So did I use it? I did never used it. I'm, I'm terrible, I know. Um, we were mostly we were outside but mostly we were inside so i just didn't use it um <laughs> terrible i know but um i figured since i knew that i'd probably like this I, I just picked this um for one of my monthly things and let's see what this is uh what is it oh it's a blush from sin to london remind me cl cheeky flush i don't I don't think I picked this, but I don't remember. Let's see what it is. So it just looks like this. 
Let's see. Oh, it's a really pretty color. It's giving off, um, it looks a lot darker in the video, but it's giving off a lot of like NARS orgasm is what I get, but more pinker. Oh, that is really pretty. That is really, really pretty. It's got a lot of sparkles, so I like that. It's pretty. All right, then I got something from Gold Fodden MD. It's a wake up call overnight regenerative facial treatment. Um, it says it has coax 10, CoQ10, 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 retinol, and avocado oil. Dr. Gold Fadden's overnight creamy facial moisturizer redefines skin, um, feel, and improves appearance of photo damaged aging skin, leaving skin looking supple, feeling plump, and appearing hydrated. So I could definitely use that. And it's made in the USA. So you like this part stuff made in the USA? Pick that up. All right. So how many things did we get so far? That was three things. All right. So we got two more. We got an Il Maquillage Black Card Lift Curl and Lengthen Mascara. I didn't even know that they made um, mascara. Have you guys ever tried that foundation? I, You know, everybody and their mom sees that so much on um, Facebook. I've just never bit the bullet on buying it. Um, but I guess they make mascara too, so. A mascara. And then the last thing that I received is something from Pear Nova. It's a liquid eyeliner. And I don't even know what of this stuff is what I picked. I know for sure I picked this, but I don't remember the rest of the stuff. So obviously just black liquid eyeliner, I suppose that's what this is. Um, feels really, really light. It just looks like so. So felt tip black eyeliner made in China. <laughs> so that's it, guys. That is my Ipsy Boxy Charm July unboxing and scent bird. Um, hope you guys are all doing well. And until my next video, take care and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.